On this episode of One Country, 100 Days, we visit five states. We cliff jump in West Virginia, whitewater paddle in Tennessee, and wake surf in North Carolina. We are now heading to DC. We don't want to deal with parking, so we're going to take the metro down. DC averages 39 inches of rain a year. That's more than Seattle. Made it to one of the Smithsonian's and we're just exploring around, looking. I think there was a little exhibit on nature photography, so we're gonna go hit that up. It was rad seeing all those landscape photographers, the award winning by National Geographic. And then we went to an Iceland room and that was pretty sick. Now we're gonna go skate down and get some tacos. Now we're gonna go skate to the White House. Maybe go visit Obama. Get to the White House, but found out that Brock isn't home. He's in Yosemite right now. When the Washington Monument opened in 1884, it was the tallest structure in the world. Checking out the nation's capital was pretty sick. It was very warm though. My phone said it got 93 degrees, so I was pretty warm. What did you think about today, Connor? Pretty rad. I, uh, I liked the best photos museum we went into. Oh uh, yeah, the Smithsonian's? Yeah, that was sweet. That was pretty awesome. Now we're gonna head down to either West Virginia or Virginia. We'll see which one we end up in. We made it to West Virginia last night and we both slept very terribly in the car. But we brought you guys to Somerville's Lake to show you around on our paddle boards. West Virginia has the oldest population of any state, with the median age being 40. Nearly 75% of West Virginia is covered by forests. West Virginia's nickname is the Mountain State, and its motto is, the Mountaineers are always free. We made it down to Dublin, Virginia. Just outside is Clayton State Park, and there's a lake right there that we're gonna go paddle in. Pretty good lighting, almost sunset time. a nice little sunset going on right behind me and I honestly did not realize that so we've been on the road now for like 42 days and my beard's got a little bit long so I bought a razor and I'm gonna go trim it that's better this is Jack Jack where are we going today we're gonna start out in popular North Carolina and we'll end up uh, in Irwin Tennessee down at USA raft all right so yeah we're hitting two states with one paddle so that's pretty awesome we haven't done that yet yeah it should be awesome catch y'all surf a little bit um what do you think the classes we're gonna hit today on the whitewater uh it's class three four it's a low level so it should be easy to navigate yeah. um so it should be a good paddle awesome yeah we're not taking ours straight up in haas um what boards are we taking down because they have the stomp box yeah well. we're gonna take the uh, atcha 86 and the atcha 96 so it's perfect for down river sup uh, also great board to surf Tennessee has more than 3,800 documented caves.
paddling the Nolichucky Gorge it is the largest gorge east of the Mississippi River. We arrived at Jaws Wave, and now we're just putting on our fins to go surfing. So we're in Tennessee. This is Matt from USA Raft. Um, what do you guys offer at USA Raft? We offer a lot of different stuff. Whitewater rafting is our core on the Nolichucky and French Broad River. We offer fly fishing, and we are really proud to be offering um, instructional whitewater stand-up paddle board. We've got great sections of river to accommodate everything. Perfect, yeah, we went out with Jack today, and that was tons of fun. Got to surf on Jaws, and right now, we're doing a little yoga. Uh, behind us every Tuesday night, is that correct? Yeah, every Tuesday night out here. So we have food trucks, we have sup yoga, we have sup demos. USA Wrap also has lodging. We do. They have a, a bunch of Airbnbs, and we were lucky enough to stay in one. That was awesome. Thank you very much for the yeah. bed, and thank you, you for the hospitality. Hey, so glad you guys came. We made it to Charlotte, North Carolina. We're meeting up with Robbie. He's uh, He takes people out on brand new Mastercrafts, teach them how to wake surf, wakeboard. You know, just have fun, share the stoke. If you're out in Charlotte and want to meet up with him, uh, here's all his contact information. Uh, you can email him there. North Carolina has 1,500 lakes and 37,000 miles of freshwater streams. Whitewater Falls is the highest waterfall in the eastern U.S. We made it out to Asheville, North Carolina. Uh, Asheville is from there. This is Ty. I've been wearing the Razzlers on most of the paddles and they're super grippy, almost as grippy as my rock climbing shoes. So we have our own G-Rubber. This is a rubber that we developed ourselves. It's non-marking. It's also razor side, so if you give it a flex there, you can see on the inside, it's got all of these little grooves. So as you flex, you're climbing up rocks, hanging out on the sup board. You're keeping that grip. Check us out online, astraldesigns.com. On the next episode, we night paddle near alligators, visit a freshwater spring, and test the hollow gear boards with two people on them. The next episode comes out July 14th at BordersMag.com.